Sagittarius. Okay. Okay, three wands cards have come up, which is definitely you here, Sagittarius. Going from the nine to the page to the king of wands, and this is quite powerful in itself. Um, I do feel like there's something that you're possibly suspicious about, but it could be a little bit tight-lipped, and you can see that with the bird here. Um, whether she's releasing the, the rope that secure his, his beak, um, it's almost like you've tried to stop or will try to stop yourself from saying something here. Um, I don't know if some ways you're feeling the grunt of that five of pentacles and in some ways something's not happening to your liking but i don't feel as though you're coming in a place you're you're at a place to say something about it um and i don't know if it's to do with the obstacles remember how i mentioned this if this is between you divine feminine divine masculine and there's sort of a card each that stands in between your way i definitely feel like there's things there's there's obstacles here for you in, in terms of your obstacles um sagittarius they've definitely come up for you here and i feel with the page of ones he's gotten himself his attitude his behavior gets himself in a sticky situation here so be vigilant of what it is that you're entering into you might hurt you might end up hurting someone or you might end up hurt very hurt yourself um sagittarius so i think some of you are playing with fire here a little bit you know the fool tends to engage in a bit of risky behavior often non nonchalant about the consequences or how it may affect others um you know, maybe this is you, not necessarily, I mean, the moon can be emotional sensitivity, so it could be that you might not even realize you're affecting someone by what you're doing, Sagittarius, but you actually might be, okay, and you actually might be causing someone to feel that five of pentacles, if it's not you, then it's definitely them feeling that kind of energy. Now, the nine of ones is, is having your guard up, and if it's not you, Sagittarius, it's someone around you, um, I feel like there's an opportunity around some of you and you know this person or this this whoever this energy is they want something with you but it's almost like you're making them work for it um, Sagittarius it's almost like you've got your guard up and there's a subtlety you can see he's being very subtle in his approach I don't know if this is you or them uh, but they're trying to be more subtle uh, about the situation they're trying to be more subtle, or you are trying to be more subtle. If this is in fact you, then it's you, but it could be a fellow fire sign you might be dealing with. But that nine of ones energy tries to blend in. Um, I think you're possibly making something appear to be not as bad as it, what, what it could be, or vice versa, it could be this person portraying that sort of energy. But... The world has a funny way of balancing itself out here with those karmic laws with the Wheel of Fortune here. But this also, this also indicates that things will most likely improve. Um, and I feel like with the Queen of Swords here, through speaking and communication, you might be able to bring back that cosmic order once again. Um, but, you know, the, the, thousand, the hundred, or what is it, a thousand eyes in Greek mythology, um, a thousand eyes of the peacock here, I feel like it's about vigilance and protection and... I mean, I think you've got the better end of the deal here. You've, you're coming up as the King of Wands. It's the car that sits in the middle of your love reading. Um, so I definitely feel it's going to be these things are happening to you, directly to you or for you. Um, and it's something that you're going to And I think with the King of Wands energy, you know, after you get yourself in that situation, after you've been fearful and you get yourself tangled in some sort of web, which you might, then you will prevail as the king of wands and i think that's where that success of the six of wands is coming in and like i said in the general reading it's all about doing the hard yards it's not going to be easy sagittarius i think some of you have a lot of work to get through in some sort of relationship um i don't know if there's a bit of lust or res you see how he's restricted restricted i don't know if someone's trying to restrict you here or you're trying to restrict yourself um, it could also be self-sabotaging behavior here, Sagittarius, and you really need to move past that because if you're wanting that healthy, you know, beautiful major arcana of the Wheel of Fortune, um, it really does mean you'll have to face these obstacles and, and talk about them, express them, um, and communication with your partner, I think, is key this month. 
let's shift over to your career and see what's happening there. Okay, two of wands, the tower, three of pentacles, king of chalices, and the ten of chalices. Okay, first of all, definitely with the happily ever after cup here, there's definitely romance that's actually impacting your career somehow, or your career may bring a romantic partner, potentially a twin flame here um, with the ten of cups. You can see these beautiful lovers card. Um, if this isn't love coming into your career sector, then I think you're working very well with the people around you, possibly in particular a water sign. Um, who's possibly coming up as the king of chalices and it could be that cancer energy um, that's coming up around you here but i do feel like you're um you're connecting with people i don't necessarily feel like i mean if there is obstacles with the tower card but you you can see here with this tower card it's not um there's not destruction happening like the house sits on the cliff it's very calm, potentially a little bit eerie. And we almost, we fear the worst. Like when we look at this house and we think, what if that cliff, uh, what if that cliff collapses and, and, and things go haywire? But that's actually not happening yet. So in, in this deck, I feel like it's more a suspicion or it's more like being on the edge, being on the edge, living on the edge. And it could be that, that sort of risk-taking behavior um, that you might be engaging in in career. Some of you are leaving career, you're leaving something behind, or there's multiple opportunities coming up around you and you might have to make a decision, potentially leaving something and starting within the same month. Um, it, there may be some very um, fair negotiation going on with the Three of Pentacles in between offers and clients, and it might be a little bit back and forth and, and, and things like counter offers up to three times could come up around you. Um, but I think I think ultimately you're going to get some sort of result that you're going to be very pleased with. You know, this beautiful stream that the King of um, Chalices represents, this is quite powerful. Um, can be Pisces energy with the fish here. It's also um, a lot to do with creativity, the creative realm. Um, but somehow your emotions are going to get heightened through work. There might be an emotional encounter. There might be something that happens. Maybe you leaving is emotional. Maybe you're forced to leave, Sagittarius. You know, the Tower card, we don't always foresee what the Tower card can bring us. And sometimes we, we go into things blindly. And, you know, it, it can get us into that situation. But ultimately, you know, you've got the Bliss card. You've got the Happiness card. And they sit above meeting someone potentially and coming into your power with the Six of Wands. So underneath it all, uh, Sagittarius, um possible negotiations i feel some of you you might come into a bit of money or be very high up or just be living the life and you could lose that very quickly because the tower card can come in and take that away from you so it's important with the solid wall here you build some sort of either savings or investments or some sort of concreteness to act as protection because if you don't you could lose it all and that could you know you could really um, really suffer with that. So I guess it's important to keep, I guess, keep long-term plans in place and to be reasonable, okay, to be sensible with what's happening around you, the circumstances. Um, but there might be an extended invitation that's on the horizon and it may take you uh, to a different city, may take you into state, could even take you nationwide around you. Absolutely. I will leave your reading at that, Sagittarius.